Well, we all know that water and electricity usage plays a huge part in making our utilities bill. But what about the other less common factors? Fox 31's Colby Gallagher connects you to the different things that affect your bill in the special report. The meter's running. As the temperature goes up, so does the urge to turn the thermostat down. While many people understand that the more severe weather can alter their water, gas, and light bill, they may be surprised to know that the mild seasons can too. We've built in 5% to increase our revenue by 5% over the next fiscal year, but that is very dependent on weather. Our, our revenues swing very high, uh, up and down, due to the kind of weather that we're having. If WGNL doesn't bring in enough monthly revenue, that 5% increase will be added on to recover the difference over the next 12 months. And that's not the only way weather can drain your account. The average monthly temperature and where you have your thermostat set can also decide the number that you see at the bottom of your bill. For example, I've had my thermostat set at 75 for all of May and June. However, my bill went up $40 because the numbers outside also went up. If it's 90 degrees outside and the humidity is 100%, the heat index is going to be higher, so it's going to work harder and run longer to keep it at 78 inside. But customers aren't the only ones feeling the bills piling up. Water, gas, and light officials say they too have felt the pain in the pocket. Our electricity has gone up over the last uh, three, four years over $20 million a year. So you're looking at almost a 30% increase in the cost that we have to pay for the electricity. Stricter environmental standards have cost the nuclear, coal, and gas fire plants water, gas, and light receives their services from, causing a trickle-down effect. Though increases have been frequent during the tough economy, officials say there are steps they've built into their bill to help people make sure the spike can't be attributed to something else. You could look at your bill from June and say, why did my water bill go up? Why is it so much higher? And you look at your May bill, you used more water. Well, if you're not watering your grass, you know that you didn't do anything unusual. Maybe you've got a leak. WGNL employees say the graph on every bill is put there to help familiarize customers with their usage pattern. If a particular month is off, that could point to a thermostat issue or leak. In order to make sure your bill doesn't rise as quickly as the temperature is outside, keep a close eye on the numbers and a tight grip on the switch. Colby Gallagher, Fox 31 News.